Hey guys, what is up? So as you guys can tell from the title, this is going to be just a normal get ready with me. I used to do these a lot back in the day, so I'm bringing them back a little bit. Or I just didn't know what to film for today, and I did this. So I did this look here that I have on right now, and I am going to be going out right now, actually. So I don't have anything else to say, but thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. So I am going to be doing the typical tape on the edge of the eye just to create a sleeker look at the end. Moving on, I am going to be priming with my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. This one is the anti-aging one. I am going to be recreating my second look using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette. And I'm going to be using the brush that the palette came with. The first color that I am grabbing is Burnt Orange. It was looking just a tad bit too orange for my liking, so what I did is I grabbed the color Warm Taupe and I toned it down just a little bit. Next, I am moving on to the color Cypress Umber. This is just a dark brown, and what I am doing now is I am concentrating this on the outer edge of the eye and bringing it in just a little bit. And what I am doing, I am just creating like a wing effect to the eyeshadow. Not only is this adding more definition to your eye, but it's also going to create this really cool ombre effect to it. I'm grabbing the color now Red Ochre, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but I am also going to be doing the same thing and just focusing this on the outer edge. I am now going to be applying the color Tempera on the lid just to brighten things up a little bit. With whatever is left on the blending brush that I used last, I am just going to be cleaning up a little bit. So things were starting to look a little bit too basic for my liking. And what I did is I went again with the color Red Ochre, and this time I applied it to the outer edge of my lid. Going again with the color Tempera. Uh, once again, I don't know how to pronounce it. These names are hella weird, but what I am doing now is just brightening up my brow bone. So I recently discovered the NYX Glitter Collection and oh my gosh, you guys, I am in love. I feel like I can do so many looks with this glitter pigment. Holy crap. So what I am doing for now is just applying the primer on the inner lid and topping that over with the silver glitter. So now I am just going to be applying a little bit of black eyeliner that is smudge proof. I am also going to be picking up some liquid black eyeliner and I'm not going to be winging this out. I'm just going to be creating the basic eyeliner line that was popular like back in the day. Curling my lashes with my Tarte Eyelash Curler and then applying some of my Estee Lauder Sumptuous Extreme Mascara. So the purpose of the tape is just to avoid any cleanup at the end and you end up with this super on fleek line. Make sure to watch my foundation routine that I uploaded recently. It is going to be down in the description and also up in the annotation above for you mobile users. We are almost done with the eye look. I am just going to be applying the color Love Letter. It is a super fuchsia pink color 
and I am applying this in my lower lash line and then with an angled brush I am really just going to be creating this double winged effect to it. I've been doing this recently in a lot of my looks and I freaking love it. Then once again I am going to be grabbing my glitter because it was looking too basic for my liking and right in between those two wings I am going to be adding a shit ton of glitter. So I had to step aside from the Modern Renaissance palette for just a little bit and I grabbed my Nude palette just to grab the color Sassy and apply that in my inner corner. Finishing off the eye look, I am just going to be applying some mascara on my lower lash line and that is it for eyes. So I decided to straighten out my hair. I also have a video on this that I did three years ago. Finishing off my makeup, I am just going to be applying the color Dusty Rose by Anastasia. And this completes the look, you guys. I hope that you enjoyed, and I'll catch you in my next one. Bye, guys. No, don't talk about that dude, my eyeliner right now. I'm not attracted, but if I don't get ready. But when I get ready, girl, you best believe. <laughs>